All right, I can't believe I'm about to address this in a video. <laughs> What's going on everyone? Back with another episode of Stuff and Things. I gotta talk about this because it keeps coming up. Roger, I haven't even told you what I'm gonna be talking about, but this is basically gonna be a story time. You can attest to how f***ing stupid it is that I even have to bring this up. What, I make holsters? No. <laughs> Not, no, this is something completely different. So about five or six months ago, I made a video called Done With Appendix Carry, my surgery story. If you wanna check it out, this is what I'm talking about. I'll leave a link for it right up here in the corner. I thought it was pretty like blatantly obvious. It was a relatively short video. It was only like eight minutes or so. And the title of the video was a play on words, or if you really wanna call it clickbait, sure, call it clickbait, whatever. The reason I'm bringing this up is because I still get comments on that video to today. It has only almost half a million views because, I mean, I obviously make a lot of video about gun stuff. People saw appendix carry and I'm done with appendix carry and they didn't take the time to watch any of the video, but you can find out really early on into the video that the title is a play on words. I was done with appendix carry because I had my appendix taken out. It was a surgery story because I was in work, blah, blah, blah. Just watch a video, you'll understand what I'm talking about. The reason I have to address this is because people keep coming up to me, even in person, people that I've met like out on the street somewhere, at a bar, they'll come up to me and they're like, oh, so now that you're not appendix carrying anymore, do you carry outside the waistband? Do you carry on your hip? Like, what do you do? It's so dumb that I even have to explain this. <laughs> I still appendix carry. I would think you should start responding saying, I just, I have appendix carry now. That, that's what I said in the video. <laughs> I, I, what else is down there? I abdomen carry, I above carry. What do you want me to call it? Belly button carry. <laughs> and I made all those jokes in that video, but people just, uh, they just watch like a quick snippet of it and they just don't get it. So to address some of the questions, yes, I still appendix carry. Yes, I mean, I've, I've been showing all of my appendix holsters in all of my videos since then. But how do you appendix carry? You don't have an appendix. That's what I said in the video. <laughs> So I appendix carry, same spot as always. It took me maybe like a week or two from after the surgery until I could like get comfortable with actually touching the whole area down here. I have three scars and whatever. Show those in the video as well. So I've been appendix carrying like normal, just not carrying my appendix inside my body. Get it? Play on words, haha, <laughs> yeah, real funny. It's like Mission Impossible. All of those movies, are those clickbait titles? Because the mission wasn't impossible if he completed the mission, right? That's a terrible reference, okay. <laughs> I can't think of anything else. It's just, it's dumb that I have to even bring this up. Another question that I get is people who go through and watch the video, they're like, oh, so carrying appendix, having a gun there all the time, that caused your appendix to be inflamed? <laughs> Dude, I'm not even making this up. People commented like that. No, carrying appendix did not cause my appendix to rupture and get all f***ed up and everything. Like, you, you have tension on there. If you wear a belt, that's going basically right across where your appendix is. Carrying a gun appendix in a QVO wingman holster, plug that real quick, that does not affect like your internal organs. It shouldn't. Unless you're like, you have a ratchet strap that you like strap down boards in the back of a truck and yeah, slam it on. Oh, just, uh, it's so dumb that I even had to start the video like this. Go watch that video and like scroll through some of the comments because I'm sure you'll be able to find them. I get them, like I said, daily, definitely weekly. Like people are still watching that video, so. He's asking you to go fight. No, don't go, don't, don't fight people in the comment section, but. Yeah, it, it's stupid. I'm okay now. I've been appendix carrying. You guys see it all the time. That's it. I'm gonna link this video in the top of the comment section of that video so I can explain. Man, people on the internet, dude. Okay, well, now that that's out of the way, we are going to be making holsters today and then going out to film some Sunday Gunday content. Right now, I'm behind on content. I typically have a video for Sunday, ready to go earlier in the week, and because of all the traveling and my camera being down last week, I do not have anything. So we're going out to catch up and then hopefully get ahead a little bit. We got a bunch of cool guns to film, one of them being the FN 509, which you guys will see us make a holster for here in a couple seconds. Should be a good day. I'm glad that you guys are liking the shorter daily life type of videos. This is why I started making videos on my channel in the first place, just kind of documenting everything that I do. So, let's get into the holster making. Without further ado.
right, holster is done. FDE carbon fiber with the black on the back, wingman with a 17 and one round in the 509 plus 24 on the side. Gives you 42 total rounds to work with. What is going on in the background? <laughs> Sorry, I'm trying to be quiet. It don't matter. I stepped on a rock and I tried to throw it out the window and I hit the wall. <laughs> I get it to the door. I'm gonna zoom in on it as it flies behind my head. <laughs> So yeah, holster's done. Uh, we're gonna be going out and filming this video today. I'm not sure if I'm gonna put this one out first or the other video, but you guys will definitely see me shooting from this thing in the future. What is for lunch, dude? We're still eating healthy. This dude. one's better. Roger has to take a picture for Instagram. I gotta first. tag my chef buddy. It does look pretty good. Turkey burger and an egg on top. And then of course, sriracha. Check that out. Bang, bang. So we're gonna eat some lunch and then head out to the desert. And I'm bringing you guys along. Hey guys, I uh, forgot to update the video. We have already finished recording one Sunday gun day, and now I'm moving on to the next. The next one being the FN 509. I need more ammo. The last gun we shot was my actually second time shooting it. I didn't get a good first impression the first time I shot it, and it was Roger's first time shooting it, so I included him and his thoughts in the video. You guys will see that either this Sunday or next, depending on which one comes out first. Dude, it's so much easier talking to a camera just like this when I'm vlogging. Like when I'm like trying to process information that is like important, dude, it, it's just so much easier to vlog like this. Hopefully you guys enjoy these videos because these are easy to do. It's loaded? No, one more. You guys are gonna start seeing talent in the gym. Uh, no, you're not. I'm gonna edit that out. <laughs> no, I won't. I can't fit a 17th round in there. Cause you don't go to the gym because it's a new mag, mother <laughs> Oh, maybe because I have a bunch of <laughs> We're gonna edit that out. <laughs> you just put it in first try. You don't go to the gym. I also, <laughs> I just loaded like 30 rounds or 30 mags from the last video. Get off me, mother Now I'm rambling. I need to finish this video before the sun sets and I'll check back after that, as long as I don't forget. All right guys, we're done filming Sunday gun days for the day. We tried to do as many as we can, but we got out here a little bit late. We were kind of tied up in the shop. Roger was tied up in the shop. I was editing videos and stuff. What's next? What are we doing today? Sun's going down. Costco. Costco. I'm happy, I love Costco. You love Costco. Costco, if you're watching this, hit me up. Talentside.com, enter a form and we can work out a sponsorship deal. <laughs> excited are you to be a guy? <laughs> How excited are you to be at Costco right now? I love Costco, man. <laughs> if Costco had a bar and a DJ and the chain smokers could come play here, yeah, I'd hang out here even more. <laughs> it's like the gates of heaven. <laughs> so you're buying clothing so you don't have to do laundry. This isn't new. <laughs> Nor is it something I'm ashamed of. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we're back at the shop and I'm beat, man. We had a long day, productive day though. Got a lot of stuff filmed, more content coming your way very soon. I guess we're gonna hang out here a little bit, edit, got a lot of editing to do, and then we're going to see Peppermint, new movie. I don't even really know what it's about. A lot of shooting and stuff though, so it should be pretty cool. If you guys watch Roger's videos, you will know that he does this thing where he puts a daily discount code in some of his videos. So if you are the first person to find that code by being on the notification squad, watching stuff as soon as they go live, then you can use that one-time code for one person, the one person who gets to it first. And he told me that I can do that on my videos while I'm out here. So if you are watching this right when the video goes live and you use this code right here, Appendix 20, Use that code right now 
and you can get 20% off of a holster order. <laughs> it's, <like> a <laughs> beep, beep, beep. it's like a strobe light. Can you turn the light on? <laughs> I'm not done. <laughs> So if you're watching this video right when it goes live, chances are you might be able to go to the site and put that code in, but like I said, it's a one-time code for the first person who gets it. After that, the code is no longer going to be active. So if you're lucky, get there first. Congratulations, you got a holster for 20% off. And if you go there, try to place an order, and it doesn't go through, it is because it has already been claimed by someone. So please don't send me a DM or write in the comments that the code doesn't work because it has already been used. So that's all that I have for today. Hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, slap a like on it. And if you're new to the channel, consider clicking subscribe because I've been making videos every day this week. And there's more coming too. So thank you guys for watching. And I will talk to you in the next one.